In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship and communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. Dear brothers and sisters, let us acknowledge our sins to be worthy to participate in this Holy Eucharist. You were sent to heal the contrite of heart. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. You came to call sinners. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. You are at the right of the Father to intercede for us. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. And may Almighty God have mercy on us. Forgive us our sins and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Let us pray. Grant us, we pray, O Lord our God, the constant gladness of being devoted to you, for it is full and lasting happiness to serve with constancy the author of all that is good. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the beginning of the book of wisdom. Love justice, you who judge the earth. Think of the Lord in goodness and seek him to integrity of heart because he is found by those who test him not, and he manifests himself to those who do not disbelieve him. For perverse counsel separate a man from God, and his power put to the fruit rebukes the foolhardy, because into a soul that plots evil, wisdom enters not nor dwells, see in a body under depth of sin. For the Holy Spirit of discipline flees deceit and withdraws from senseless counsels. And when injustice occurs, it is rebuked. For wisdom is a kindly spirit, yet she acquits not the blasphemer of his guilty lips, because God is the witness of his inmost self and the sure observer of his heart and the listener to his tongue. For the Spirit of the Lord fills the world, is all-embracing, and knows what man says. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Responsorial Psalm. Guide me, Lord, along the everlasting way. Guide me, Lord, along the everlasting way. O Lord, you have probed me and you know me. You know when I sit and when I stand. 
You understand my thoughts from afar. My journeys and my rest, you scrutinize. With all my ways, you are familiar. Guide me, Lord, along the everlasting way. Even before a word is on my tongue, behold, O Lord, you know the whole of it. Behind me and before, you have me in, and rest your hand upon me. Such knowledge is too wonderful for me, too lofty for me to attain. Guide me, Lord, along the everlasting way. Where can I go from your spirit? From your presence, where can I flee? If I go up to the heavens, you are there. If I sing to the netherworld, you are present there. Guide me, Lord, along the everlasting way. If I take the wings of the dawn, if I settle at the farthest limits of the sea, even there your hand shall guide me, and your right hand hold me fast. Guide me, Lord, along the everlasting way. Please all stand. your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Saint Luke. Glory to you, Lord. Jesus said to his disciples, things that cause sin will inevitably occur, but woe to the one through whom they occur. It it would be better for him if a millstone were put around his neck and he be thrown into the sea than for him to cause one of these little ones to sin. Be on your guard. If your brother sins, rebuke him. And if he repents, forgive him. And if he wrongs you seven times in one day and returns to you seven times saying, I am sorry, you should forgive him. And the apostle said to the Lord, Increase our faith. The Lord replied, If you have faith the size of a mustard seed, you would say to this mulberry tree, Be uprooted and planted in the sea, and it would obey you. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. We welcome you, dear brothers and sisters, pilgrims, and parishioners as well in this National Shrine and Paris of St. Padre Pio. Also, we welcome those joining us in our celebration 
through our live streaming. Today is Monday of the 32nd week in Ordinary Time. And the readings for this remaining three weeks will focus more on the end times. The theological term used is parousia, which means the second coming of Christ, or in layman's term, the end of the world, gunaw. That's why the readings are a warning to us. Like these days, Readings. Yung pong salitang iskandalo, iskandal, sa simpleng paliwanag, pag sinabing iskandal, ikinatitisod, yun ay ibig ng to be scandalous. Somebody falls, natisod. Yun ang ibig sabihin ng iskandal, iskandalo. Natitisod ang iba. And Jesus is strongly advising those who are causes of others to sin, tie a millstone around the neck, and throw oneself to the sea. Mas mabuti pa kaysa maging iskandalo. It is a negative side of the readings. But we reflect more on the positive side of the Word of God for us. Faith has many characteristics sa tao. Forgiving, rebuking a brother or sister is not only to attain good human relation. It's deeper than that. Rebuking, forgiving our brothers and sisters comes from the grace of faith within us. Pananampalataya po. Hindi lang sa pati kayong magandang kalooban at kayong magaling makipagkapuha, pwede yun. But deeper than that, correcting our brothers and sisters, forgiving them, comes from a deeper faith. Sapagkat, hindi naman mimisa lang, nagkakasala ang ating kapwa eh. Ang iyong asawa. Yan kayo misa lang magkasala sa iyo. Araw-araw nga eh. Lalo pag kami kabit pa. Hindi araw-araw eh. Nagkakasala sa iyo. Ay hindi kaya mong patawarin ng ang iyong kaloob ay maganda laang. Hindi kayo hindi naman. It needs a deeper faith. Kaya sa bandang huli ng gospel, pananampalataya ang tinumbok ni Jesus. If you have faith, like the seed of, like a master seed, you can move mountains. You can forgive the unforgivable. Because of faith. At am um, Baga na ito, mga, mga kapatid, ay itong pananampalatayang ito ay sa maliliit nagsisimula, hindi sa malalaki. Kaya pa itong Diyos na ito na napakadakila at napakalaki ay nagpakaliit. 
mas maliit pa kaysa atin. You read the letter of Paul to the Philippians, chapter 2, verses 4 to 11. Pag-uwi ninyo. Pilipos, chapter 2, verse 4 to 11. Mababasa niyo doon. Ang Diyos nagpakaliit, mas maliit pa kaysa atin. Kaya hindi po katakataka, yun ang kanyang invitation sa atin. Kaya si giliw na giliw sa mga maliliit. Giliw na giliw ang Diyos sa maliliit. He is fond of little ones. Kaya sabi niya, be on guard. You might be a scandal to these little ones. Because God loves the little ones. Why? Because the little ones have pure, deeper faith and trust in God. For your offerings in the envelope, you may drop them at the collection boxes. Blessed are you, Lord of the fall creation, for to your goodness, we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth, and work of human hands. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord of the full creation, for to your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine, and work of human hands. It will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Please all stand. Pray, my dear brothers and sisters, that our sacrifice and thanksgiving to God be made acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His holy church. Grant, O Lord, we pray, that what we offer in the sight of your majesty may obtain for us the grace of being devoted to you and gain us the prize of everlasting happiness through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks, Father, most holy, through your beloved Son, Jesus Christ, your word to whom you made all things, whom you sent as our Savior and Redeemer, incarnate by the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin, fulfilling your will and gaining for you a holy people, he stretched out his hands as he endured his passion so as to break the bonds of death and manifest the resurrection. And so, with the angels and all the saints, we declare your glory as with one voice we acclaim. Holy, 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 Lord God of hosts, heaven and earth, of all your glory, the Son in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the 
able to kneel, please remain standing with reverence. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy therefore these gifts we pray by sending down your spirit upon them like the dew fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion. He took bread and, giving thanks, broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. When we eat this bread and drink this song, we proclaim your death, O Lord, until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have made us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, you may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church is spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis our Pope and Gilbert our Bishop and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them all into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, Our Lady of Kaisasai, with Saint Joseph, her most dear spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, with Saint Padre Pio, our beloved patron, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you to your Son, Jesus Christ. Through Him and with Him and in Him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, our glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. At 
the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to sing. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be Forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray from every evil. Grace, grant peace in our days that by the help of your mercy, may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you, look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Offer its other the sign of peace. Peace be with you. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy. Take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Grant us peace. Those who are unable to kneel, please remain standing with reverence. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold Him who takes away the sins of the world, blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under, under my, my roof, roof, but only but say, say the, the word, and my, and my soul, soul shall, be, shall healed. be healed.
which will be done is for the continuing development of the Paris and National Shrine of St. Padre Pio. Thank you for your offering. We adore you, we believe in you, O Lord. Deliver us, save us, O Let us all stand. Let us pray. We have partaken of the gifts of the sacred mystery, humbly imploring, O oh Lord, that what your Son commanded us to do in memory of him may bring us growth in charity through Christ our Lord. Amen. Prayer for intercession to Santo Padre Pio. Padre Pio, holy monk from Pietrasina, outstanding saint of the present era, our bright beacon in this earthly pilgrimage, our sanctuary in times of trouble, holy exemplar of great courage, with you our needs do we confide, as well our livelihood, our health, and our might. Unworthy as we are, we pray that you concede, bless and grace us, that our lives may be fulfilled. From sin may we abstain, in God may we remain. We also beseech thee, servant, servant of, of the, the Most Holy, Holy to instruct us, us in the gospel, gospel that we may reflect and believe. And believe. Our, requests our requests are before thee, thee. our hearts our repent, repent resolving earnestly to not to sin again, again, to always follow God the Father, the Father together, together with the Spirit, with the Spirit Jesus and the Jesus the Mediator. The Mediator. Amen. Amen. Ang lahat po ay magsiupo para sa mga patalastas. Una, sa inyong pagdalaw sa pambansan dambana, mangyaring pakaingatan ang inyong mga personal na gamit. Hangad namin ang isang matiwasay at maayos na pagbisita sa National Shrine. Ikalawa, nakahanda na po sa bandang unahan ng main church ang paglalagyan ng mga sobring may pangalan ng inyong mga mahal na yumao. Buong buwan natin, pagdadasal ang kapayapaan ng kanilang kaluluwa. Makipag-ugnayan lamang po kayo sa ating mga tagapaglingkod. Ikatlo, mga kapiyo, kami po ay humihingi na inyong kaunting oras at pakikiisa para sa pagsusulat na inyong pangalan at ilang detalye sa ating Pilgrim's Information Record Book na makikita sa paligid ng Divine Mercy Sanctuary sa main charts sa main store at iba pang lugar dito sa Pambansan Dambana. Ito po ay bilang bahagi ng documentation program para sa pagpapalawig ng datos at turismong pangsimbahan para sa pagbabasbas na religious articles. Mga minamahal na kapatid, manalangin tayo sa Diyos. 
amang makapangyarihan upang tayo ay maging kawang si Kristo sa, pag, sa taimtid na pagdalangin sa tulong ng mga larawan at mga dasalan. O Panginoon Diyos, kayo po ang bukal ng lahat ng pagkapala at biyaya, ibuhos niyo po ang inyong bindisyon sa lahat ng mga gamit na ito sa panalangin, mga rosaryo, imahin, dasalan na nagpapaalaala ng inyong kabutihan, kabanalan at pagmamahal sa amin upang ang lahat na dumulog at magdasal gamit ang mga ito ay magtabo ng iyong awat biyaya. Loobin niyo pong tularan nila ang kabanalan at aral ng Panginoon at lahat ng mga santo magpasawalang hanggan. Amen. Ama namin, sumasalangit ka, sambahin ang ngalan mo, mapasa amin ang kaharian mo, sundin ang loob mo dit sa lupa para nang sa langit. Bigyan mo kami ngayon ang aming kakanin sa araw-araw at patawarin mo kami sa aming mga sala para nang pagpapatawad namin sa nagkakasala sa amin at huwag mo kami ipaintulot sa tukso at iadya mo kami sa lahat ng masama. Amen. Abagi noong Maria, napupuno ka ng grasya, ang Panginoong Diyos ay suma sa iyo. Bukod kang pinagpala sa babaeng lahat at pinagpala naman ng iyong anak na si Jesus. Santa Maria, ina ng Diyos, ipanalangin mo kaming makasalanan, ngayon at kung kami mamamatay. Amen. Luwalhati sa Ama, sa Anak, at sa Espiritu Santo, kapara noong una, ngayon at magpasawalang hanggan. Amen. Pagkapanalangin sa mga kaluluwa, kapayapaan kailanman na igawad na may kapal sa mga yumao nating mahal. Sa nawa sila ay sila ay ng ilaw, ng ilaw na walang hanggan. hanggan. May the souls of our beloved loved ones, all the souls in purgatory, all the souls of the faithful departed, through the mercy of God, rest in peace. Amen. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you all, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass has been offered Go with the peace and love of Christ. Thanks be to God. Give thanks with a grateful heart. Give thanks to the Holy One. Give thanks because He's given this Christ His heart. Give thanks.